Right, hello and welcome back to Death Roads Tournament. So, I've got a new cunning plan today that I'm going to try out, just as mixing it up. So, we've not done a bashing build in a while. It's been a few episodes. Uh, can we... how many... Hmm. I'm just wondering how many repair shops will hit here. It's not bad. We have to go to a shop here, but potentially only one fight. Uh, and I would go to this one rather than this one, because then there's only two fights before the shop, and then we just have to make it through this stint, basically, and we'll probably be fine. Right. So, bit of a new idea. So my thinking is, basically, we've got all these weapons on us, right? Now, you look at these weapons and it's like, well, how does this help me? This is a waste dead card at the moment. Not very good. Okay, right then. Well, what if they were good? What if instead we have loads and loads of maneuverability cards? So instead of taking weapons, I mean, I'm literally, what I'm suggesting is we strip the card of weaponry. Is what I'm now thinking. We'll move it closer. Cold fusion. Smash and again. Gotcha. So, yeah, we'll replace our wheels straight away because ours are terrible. But, yeah, I'm literally, I'm thinking the only reason we would want weapons is if they've got some kind of condition modifier, like they make our bashers better or give us certain cards. Otherwise, it's just diluting our deck with needless weapon cards. If we can just smash the truck into them, we do as much damage anyway, and it gives us more maneuverability. So why not just remove our weapons? Makes sense. Ish. <laughs> right. Fusion here. Get him. There we go. We don't need a weapon. We've just killed him with one. Why do we need a weapon? We don't. Uh, we can. Yeah, we can definitely take them. And so, we're going to do it without guns. Pacifist gun. <laughs> right, and cold fusion. I said cold fusion. Go. Bong. Not a problem. Already tearing through. Um, uh, no, ours is better. I mean, the rumble is not a bad idea, I'll be honest, but we'll just be taking that for the scrap. Like I said, we're not equipping any weapons whatsoever. No weapons will be used. Ooh. Hello. It's pretty good. Um
Alright, let's smash through these. Probably should get down actually there. Okay, let's see what they do. They'll probably spend most of their turn getting back to me. They'll probably not be able to shoot. So, as expected, that's exactly what we've done. Um, called fusion and friction. Again, we're not really. None of these are particularly great. Most likely, we'll have plenty of things at the shop actually. We'll be able to buy some stuff. <laughs> right. Gold fusion away. If anything, making them lose handling when we're ramming them is a bad thing. Because it, it puts them out of position when we're about to hit them more. Turn. We'll then probably cold fusion and smack him. Ooh, that hurt. Yeah, the only problem with this is we probably stand to lose a lot of health. Because of just getting right in the faces. There we go. Ooh. Now that's a set of wounds. Extra bash damage modifiers. There we go. We 
We don't really have enough... Uh, enough oh, mind you, we could have sold some things. We'll be right. We can do some business up here. Okay. Fiction. Great, we should be out of range of this first one. So we shouldn't have to deal with one now. That's probably about as well as that could have gone. Right. Uh this this one's gonna have to go. We can probably use Yeah, smart move would be a good well it'd be a smart move. I absolutely want to do that. <laughs> like I said, making him lose that much condition, not a good thing all, all the time. his entire turn getting here and then we get to make the move on him. At the very least it lets us uh, we need some better uh, wheels I think. But oh well. Oh we don't even need um Old fusion do we? We've already got six bash modifier. Without, uh, without it. Right, there we go. Done and dusted. Uh, so, for example, this might be worth picking up. It's like, okay, um, it can weaken them so they take more damage. It can, what's it, uh, lock up, lock them up from using engine cards, that sort of thing. It's, it's a definite maybe. I think uh, getting a good engine right now would be quite good. I've already got a decent one, but Breaking Bad is great, Sequential is great. Yeah, I don't think this is good enough to replace it. Uh, Anticipation is good. Lookout is. Um, I think mine is just bet better than me. I'm sure this has a better armor modifier there. You know, it's got a better modifier on it, but... I think we'll collect that because it looks a bit rarer than the others with the high modifier on it. And we'll just sell it. Right, okay, we need to watch out for this guy. Um, let's get rid of Bash. Let's 
assume this is just gonna like knock him way over, isn't it? Probably. Oh, I move as well. Oh god. <laughs> okay, that's funny. That's actually funny. Ah, yeah, because it's a move. This is a bash to the side, so you don't move. But that other one, yeah, you do actually move. So you hit them twice at high gear. Ha! Okay. Um, we'll just let that thing catch up. Friction will probably kill it next turn. Who needs weapons? <laughs> okay, this is the sort of thing that might actually be something we would put on. It comes with bash modifier and it can be used to maneuvers and that. That, yeah. If we're going to put a weapon on, it has to be something that suits the build. Not just any weapon will do here. So now we're a giant battering ram with a jet engine on the back. Lovely. There we go. Right. Um... Just get rid of Ash. Right. Um, okay, evil plan then. Cold fusion. Friction. Probably still gonna shoot them, but it's on low health now at least. So I'll probably come out of this with only take them off this. Yeah. Okay. Cold fusion. Dash. 
gotcha. Right, we're getting a good amount of scrap. Ooh, what have we got here? Ah, so Vorvat does give us some handling. Again, I'm not that fussed about making the moves control anyway, but it doesn't give us mu as much uh, flexibility in turning to the sides, really. But Iron Fist, I would argue, is as good, if not better, than most of those cards I have on that. Yeah. If there were maybe like two Iron Fists, as you know, two Iron Fist cards attached to these, then maybe, but as it stands, no. No, thank you. So, we'll collect, but we'll not equip. One more. One more fight, and we've made it through. And it's the same fight we just had. Right, okay. do that, I'll discard a bunch of random cards though. Hmm. Right, that should work. That drone's getting nowhere near. So we just ended up losing some bash damage for a little bit. That'll be fine. Down. Didn't realise that wasn't going to kill him. Okay. Right. We'll just have to make some space, I guess. There we go. Turn we'll go for him. It's too bad we're taking these little bits of damage around in the meantime for him. Right. Hello. Wrong. Right. That solves that problem. Bonus hand when we say, and we can put them into us. I mean, it works with the build.
Now I wonder what's going to happen here because we've already unlocked this person. So I'm thinking maybe we unlock something different. Maybe we'll get their car or something. Could be a good question that. I'd like an answer. Right. We'll get rid of Bash. Hello. And friction. that but ah we don't have the handling left okay oh it's a spike strip that they've got on ah and loud speakers okay we're gonna absolutely tear this apart Damn, they put a lot of rumble on me though, didn't they? Mm. Have I got wheel lock on? Yeah, you absolute. Git. Yeah, and that's just applying more, and oh god, the rumble. <laughs> this might be a quick episode then. Yep, there goes 20. All my cards are locked. So I've just got infinite wheel lock now. turn, we need rid of that wheel, wheel lock. Right, we're ahead of them, I don't think they can get us with it anymore. So they're going to rumble me to death here. I have to kill them next turn. Basically. Great, and they've moved really far away. Yeah, we die to rumble. I don't think there's anything I can do. Yep. That's a really cheap way of... That's a really cheap way of doing that. God. So you've got like three turns in which to kill them before they just kill you via rumble. That's awful. I mean, I know we've beaten that boss before. Because we've unlocked that character, but that is just a nasty fight. Feels very cheap. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. That's been Death Road's Tournament. I'll see you in future episodes. See you then.